Hi everybody, my name is Mary and today I will be watching Game of Thrones Season 3 Episode 6 for the first time. Let's go! Hey everybody, welcome back. It's been a few days since I recorded but I have some time again to watch a few episodes in a row and hopefully I might be able to record some more the next couple of days which I'm super excited for. We're starting the second part of this season which I always feel a bit like double about because you know that things are gonna go wrong but maybe not yet in episode six you know I think six seven will still be fine we shall see I'm at least very excited for it I've been loving this show I must say that this show closest resembles what I would do before I start this channel I wouldn't really watch movies but this type of series is something that I absolutely love and I didn't know I was gonna love it as much as I do but I I completely fall on for it so thank you so much for being here with me and sharing this journey it's definitely nice to read all the comments and know that you're all like living through it again it's really nice thank you so much for that if you like the reaction make sure to like and subscribe and as always if you want to see the full one you can do that over on patreon where I post full watch long style reactions it also supports me a lot because I can work with editors to make this channel better Thank you so much. Let's get into it. Kind of need to remember a bit where we were the last time. Where did we finish? It's funny, every time I do reactions to Game of Thrones, I'm super nervous when I start the evening again. But like from the first 20 minutes, I'm just like rolling again in the binge watching. <laughs> Got these. Do you know this Ferrero Rocher's as a gift? And I would say, not sponsored, but wish it was. <laughs> oh, what was the name of that sea? Gulf of Grief. I feel like I never paid attention to the seas before. Awesome. It needs to breathe. Take off that big lock. <laughs> Instant result. It doesn't get so cold down in the reach. And they were servants, of course. I knew you were highborn. Oh, they're so wholesome together. I'm not sure that it does anything. It's beautiful, though, isn't it? It probably doesn't give a damn. <laughs> 700 feet high, all made of ice. On a warm day, you can see it weeping. Oh, the wall weeps. <laughs> Do you sing? No. No, no, no. Not very well. Sing me a song. Yes. Oh. Do it. All right. The baby is so calm. A father's face is stern and strong. He sits and judges right from wrong. Her gentle smile ends all strife. Oh. That's not how you skin a rabbit. I know how to skin a rabbit. Not by the looks of it. I feel uh, this episode is an exercise in uh, surviving skills. <laughs> you grow up north of the wall, you'll learn the proper way to handle game. I didn't see any game before I got here. Well, I made this by myself. Guess you don't learn how to do that north of the wall. It's not a competition. Oh, you're going to punch the rabbits to death. You're both very good at skinning rabbits. <laughs> of us. Well, some of us would say thank you when someone else hunts down their breakfast for them. Why don't they teach you to say thank you north of the wall? Who cares? Just... Stop it! <sighs> Lady Reed has got a stick so far up her ass it's a wonder her feet touch the ground. You've been nasty to her every day. First time I met her, she put a knife to my throat. First time I met you, you held a knife at me. We can't fight each other. We'll never make it to the wall. I want you both to make peace. Listen to the kid. I'm sorry. Your way of skinning rabbits is quicker than mine. I said so, didn't I? Oh, yeah. <laughs> You're a good little hunter. Thank you. See? Not so hard, is it? Thank you. <laughs> What's wrong with him? The visions take their toll. What disease does that? That you get like in, is it an epic... Leptical shock? Well, it's a long way up and a long way down, but I've waited my whole life to see the world from up there. I'm glad she's so positive about this trip. You killed someone for them? Nah. I didn't kill him. But I bet his balls are still bruised. Mm -hmm. oh. 
Well, he didn't do that thing you do with your tongue. Yeah, can we not talk about that here? Can There's we talk people. About here? Well, I'm Jon Snow. I've killed dead men and Corrin Afan, but I'm scared of naked girls. Did I seem scared the other day? <laughs> you were trembling like a leaf. Only in the beginning. <laughs> Only in the beginning. You're a proper lover, Jon Snow. And don't worry. This is the moment that all the fans went like, whoa! You didn't stop being a crow the day you walked into Mansa Raider's tent. If he's doing this little act, why didn't he like act now instead of just going like, <gasps> You're going to be loyal to your. Oh, whoa. Wife. Don't ever betray me. I'm so conf. Does loyalty work like this? You're loyal to me now. Because I'll cut your pretty cock right off and wear it around me neck. It's a good incentive. To be loyal. <laughs> I'm gonna try that one. <laughs> Face, tits, balls. I hit him right where I wanted to. Aye. Well, you took your sweet time of it. There's someone out there. Oh, God. That's about far enough. Oh, whoa. Thought I was going to be a are these all languages like Dothraki and this that they made? My friends here don't speak High Valyrian. Why are you here, my lady? Forgive my manners. I don't see many ladies these days. <laughs> ladies. <laughs> Whoa, sick bird. <laughs> How many times has the Lord brought him back? Six. I'm glad they're so confident that they can keep bringing him back. By the time I came to Westeros, I didn't believe in our Lord until the mountain drove a lance through this one's heart. Our God is the one true God. To be fair, their God has done some amazing things already, so I can see that. <laughs> You've been to the other side. There is no other side. Adele was there. I didn't like that woman. That's because you're a girl. <laughs> What does that have to do with anything? Oh. <laughs> what are you doing? Let go of him! We serve the Lord of Light. And the Lord of Light needs this boy. Did the Lord of Light tell you that or did she? Oh, they sold him. You are more than they can ever be. They are just foot soldiers in the Great War. You will make kings rise and fall. Why do they need him? Like, I, I know what he is, but do they know? I see a darkness in you. And in that darkness, eyes staring back at me. Brown eyes. Blue eyes. Green eyes. Eyes you'll shut forever. We will meet again. Whoa, I have chills! Do the names have exactly those eyes? Eye colors in that order? I want to keep up with that. <sighs> Dear God, I'm so afraid of heights. <sighs> this, <laughs> this doesn't help. Where <laughs> she gets the energy. <gasps> oh! Just seeing if you can take a hit, lad. I love how they can all be funny in such miserable situation. <laughs> Oh, I forgot about him. Oh, sorry. Were you sleeping? Two creeps together. You want some water? I wish I had some for you. He's gonna throw it on the yeah, floor. <laughs> so let's play. A game. I don't want to play a game. Which body part? Do you oh, do not this? even that game. <laughs> Although it sounds incredibly fun. You've already told me everything. Remember? How about your little finger? You don't use that for much, do you? No? Good. Let's start with that. I'm not a fan of this torture situation. You've been wondering why you're Yes, here. kinda. Who I am, why I'm doing this to you. If you guess right, I'll tell you. If I win, you'll let me go. If you think this has a happy ending, you haven't been paying attention. You first. Where are we? Deepwood Mott. <laughs> Terrible guess. 
I don't want to look at this. I betrayed Rob. That's why you're torturing me. You win. He's gonna be pissed off. You forgot to ask one question. You forgot to ask if I'm a liar. La 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 I'm afraid I am. No 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 no. Oh, entertaining. I win. Cheater. Oh, that was a long torture scene. Lord Frey requires a formal apology for your violation of your sacred oath to marry one of his daughters. It's not going to be the only thing. We will do whatever we can to give Lord Frey what he needs. Not what. Whom. What? What? <laughs> uh, no. Our father requires Lord Edmure. Oh, I would be pissed off! Can I see her first? You want to count her teeth? We depart for the twins in the morning. Oh, he violated the promise and now he needs to take a shit for it. <laughs> Why should I let that old ferret that choose old my bride ferret. Me? If you refuse our alliance with the ferret. Ah, oh, you're the last one to say that. When I say no, you will come back and offer me a daughter of my choosing. You're willing to risk our freedom and our life. Yeah! Something that I the hypocrisy. You said you wanted to make amends for the stone mill. You recall that heroic engagement? I had something less permanent. <laughs> I was gonna say mind. that. Like, I'm sorry, now we're gonna be married forever to someone I don't like. <laughs> if we don't do this and do it now, we're lost. I think I would just like they have no choice right but i think i would ask him like more in the, like i know you don't want to but yeah this yes it is not fair i'll remember it okay good that he admit that oh god i see my men have finally found you something appropriate to wear yes most <laughs> why did nobody like nobody helps him more <laughs> i should send you back to rob stark you should. Instead, you're sitting here watching me fail at dinner. Why might that be? Wars cost money. Many people would pay a great deal for you. We both know who would pay the most. Them Lannisters. As soon as you're well enough to travel, I will allow you to go to King's Landing, and you will swear to tell your father the truth, that I had nothing to do with your maiming. Seems like a good deal for them. Shall we drink on it? I don't partake. What about her? My lady? Our journey continue without further incident. Oh, she won't be going with you. I'm afraid I must insist. You're in no place to insist on anything. I would have hoped you'd learned your lesson about overplaying your position. Uh, this is so odd, though, because you want him to keep his word as well. He could arrive at his father's and then tell him, like, hey, he did me me. So I would not piss him off too much either if you're planning to bring him back to his father. I'm something of an expert on the subject. Her change will be upon her before long. I'll spare you the details of what will happen then. You men may have a stomach for bloodshed and slaughter, but this is another matter entirely. Well, the years punish us as well, I oh. promise you. That. The only thing that might turn it are details of your grandson's nocturnal activities. Do you deny them? Oh, not at all. A sword swallower through and a through. A sword swallower. Did you grow up with boy cousins, Lord Tywin? Sons of your father's bannermen, squires, stable boys. Of course. And you... Swallowed a sword? Never... Oh. No. Not in any way? Never. Perhaps High Garden has a high tolerance for unnatural behavior. True, we don't tie ourselves in knots over a discreet bit of buggery, but brothers and sisters... Ooh, wow, she won this round. I don't care what people believe, and neither do you. As an authority on myself. As I an authority on myself. <laughs> and House Tyrell is throwing its prize flower into the dirt. And if Cersei is too old to give Laura's children, we are throwing another prize flower into the dirt. It is a chance we simply cannot take. If you refuse to marry Loras to Cersei, I will name him to the King's Guard. I'm sure you're familiar Ah, low blow. He will never marry. He will never have children. He won this round. And High Garden will go to the children of Joffrey and Marjorie. So he will not have children 
in any of the options. <laughs> or do you consent to this match? Because I don't think like the child with Cersei option is a very enough thing. fruitful one either. Man who lives up to his reputation. <gasps> Whoa! I wouldn't mess with him. <laughs> Meanwhile, still on the wall. It's gonna be three episodes of them climbing up there. <laughs> oh! Oh, you're dead. Oh my god. No! <clears throat> ah! No way! We gotta throw them loose! No! <gasps> Can you not, yeah, like swing to the sun. I don't know. He's gonna make it right in time. Right in time. Right in time. One more swing. Yes. Ah! Oh, that's a heavy. Whoa. Would your back break from something like this? Oh, I love a good adrenaline rush of romance on the wall combined with the fear of death. If they all make it, they're gonna have a little bit of trouble. It's a hard one though, because would the other two have been able to make it if they didn't cut them loose? Like, was it actually the only option or not? I'm very happy. Uh, yes. I am as well. I feel like I'm in a dream. <laughs> oh man, I feel like she deserves a little bit more luck in life. I've been to a large wedding since I was quite young. The guests, the food, the tournaments. The bride. And Yikes! <laughs> I don't suppose there's anything we can do about this? You'd have them both killed. There are two people in King's Landing who can give an order to a King's Guard. Did you or did you not order Sir Mandon to kill me during the Battle of the Black Water? The impulse I understand. So, fair enough. He wants me dead. But his stupidity? He could have had me poisoned and no one would have known. What do you want me to say? I want you to tell me if my life is still in danger. Probably, but not from Joffrey. He won't do anything now, father's here. All these... Your kid wanting to murder your brother. Oh. Who's going to tell her? Will they let me invite my family? They haven't asked my opinion. But do you think they will? No. <laughs> no, they don't give a f*** about you. <laughs> Lady hey, Sansa Lord Tyrion to see you. Should I? I beg your pardon, my lady. Give her a second! Good afternoon, Lord Tyrion. I was just trying on a gown for King Joffrey's wedding. Oh no, and oh she's there. Why do you need to speak to her alone? Shay, don't Shay. talk to him like that. You don't know Please each other. Her, Lord Tyrion. She's not from here. But I trust her. Even though she tells me not to. Oh. Sometimes. We think we want to hear something. And it's only afterwards, when it's too late, that we Realize. Maybe you should have told her first. It's all right, really. Right? Then he could have told her nicely instead of telling his sons off first. This is awkward. The Lysa Aaron of chairs. Shame you had to settle for your second choice. But your confidant, the one who fed you information about my plans, she was a bad investment on my part. Luckily. I have a friend. Oh he wants no. To try something new. Something no. daring. And he was so grateful to me for providing this fresh experience. Oh God. I did what I did for the good of the realm. The realm. Do you know what the realm is? Chaos isn't a pit. Chaos is a ladder. No! No, not him! No at the boat! No! Um, like Holy climb, shit! Only the ladder is real. The climb is all there is. I thought it was a calm episode. 
Guess I was wrong. <laughs> ah, the views. Pretty. <laughs> Still wouldn't climb three days to see that. <laughs> oh, they made it. Congratulations. And her man saved her. Aww. And then you think about that woman who was pierced on the bed by arrows from a psychopath kid. God, I'm still a bit in shock. <laughs> like we knew he was a creep and that he had weird references. But to actually shoot someone with arrows close up multiple times is a uh, well my poor Sansa I'm still in shock how my opinion changed about her from season one where I thought she was this little brat and then like she got every misery over her I really w like I really hope that things are gonna go better for her soon I feel like she got a fair share of shit already <sighs> I'm so curious to see where this is gonna go there are so many intrigues and family planning and i'm gonna i'm curious to see who's gonna end up with who also very curious to see how it's gonna go with jamie and with Arya's trip we shall see i hope you like this reaction today if you did make sure to like and subscribe the full episode you can watch with me on patreon and i'm gonna jump in the next one i'll see you soon <laughs> bye